Welcome, I'm Wes, and we're gonna do some paintings together. I wanna to share my uh, process with you guys, how I do what I do, and I'm not gonna drop any ancient secrets on you guys, or give you any master techniques. I'm just gonna share what I do, and I've kind of stripped uh, the painting process down to something very simple. It's just literally oil paint and linseed oil. That's how we get to where we are here. Very simple, it's very safe. We took out a lot of the thinners, a lot of the harsh chemicals. Like I said, I don't know if anybody saw the teaser, but you know, we, we want to be safe. We don't want anybody dropping on the floor because of, uh, of fumes. But we're gonna time lapse through this one. We're gonna time lapse through this first, then we will come back in extra videos that will show different parts of what I've done to get to here. It has been a process, a learning process, trial and error, lots of errors, figuring out how to record this, but each one will get better. We're gonna get there. And by us, I mean me and you guys because there's nobody else here in this room. So that's part of the learning process, how to capture this as one person and know, know that I'm capturing it correctly. So we are gonna get there together. It's gonna to be a journey. We're gonna like it. I'm gonna like it. Hope you like it, but we'll talk about this because this is pretty good. I'm pretty happy with this. We're gonna do it together. We're gonna to have fun. It might be a little weird. I'm not your typical artist. I'm more just a painter. I, I, I just wanna, you know, kinda of share what I do. Contribute to the community. I don't know. We're working on this. Working on the format. You know, I've gotta get a catchphrase. I've gotta get a opening line, closing thing. You know, this this is not gonna cut it. Hang in there. We'll, we'll, this is gonna be fun. We're, I, later it'll be fun. The more videos we do, the the more fun it will be. You thought I was gonna say funner, but I said the more fun it will be. Yeah, so I'm gonna stop talking, stop rambling. I may commentary a little bit during the, the time lapse. If I deem necessary, I may not. All right, so let's do this. We're gonna do it, right? Okay. <laughs> So you thought we were going to kind of come in with some nice music tracks or something like that. Mm. Music's expensive. It's complicated. There's copyright laws. All we're doing is me talking about what's happening. So we're laying in all the dark colors because we're going to build from the back to the front. So dark colors are in the back. We, as we come forward, the colors get, get much lighter. Uh, and, and we work on highlights. So we're working on the darks and the hair. This is all stuff that, this, this is shapes, blocking in colors and, and building layers right now. Uh, it, this, none of this really matters and this is all wet. So it's all kind of blending together. The, all this stuff really works and hair is awesome if you get it right. Work with big brushes. Don't try and make little strokes and individual hairs get all this stuff with a big uh, one inch or bigger brush and bring in those layers, you know, use brushes that have like bad bristles and stuff. Just kind of come in and, and make big strokes and whoosh, hit it. Uh, blend that background together with the hair while it's still wet. That way it looks soft. It doesn't look like it's just layered on top of it. So bringing in all these highlights, while it's still wet, we'll, we're gonna have to come back later with some true highlights because it's still wet and the highlights will just soak it up. Uh, so we're gonna move to the to the eye, to the face now. Eyes are pretty fun, you know. Uh, this is where you build a lot of the character that's gonna happen, a, a lot of the emotion. This is what makes that person who it is. If you don't get the eye right, you you might as well forget you could the, the the hair could be perfect the the skin tones the the shadows the depth could be awesome your eyes wrong and you know you, you might as it, it's scrapped this is where you make it work this is what makes it look like that person so you know now we've changed to a new camera angle this is more fun uh this is a true time lapse uh, the other was some video that we recorded uh, I'm making faces at the camera because uh, it entertains me. She's got great freckles. Love those freckles. I couldn't make them work. They looked great at some certain points, and then as I started moving stuff around, I lost them, and I had to scrap them. So uh, this this happened in the first painting that I did, the blue one. The the. Freckle, I, you know, that's something I got to work on as a person, but 
Okay, we're zooming in. Now we can start to see some of the detail. We've just been building shapes, building layers. Now we're starting to build in some of this nice detail. And we're, we're you know, up until probably this point, I was working with big half inch to quarter inch brushes. Uh, now we're starting to work with some of the, you know, smaller brushes, make those highlights. And I've got a, a detail brush that's I don't know what I don't know exactly what it is, but I love the brush. I kind of use it as a blending. Oh, hey, look, we're 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 finished. So there we go. So we're done. This style that I like, it's got detail, not such fine detail that it is you know hyper realism or anything like that. It still looks like a painting. There are still brush strokes. There are still good things that make you just go, mm, look at that painting. But it looks like the person we want it to look like. As a matter of fact, it looks like the first painting that I did that was just more of a warm and cool tone study in reds and blues. But I, for you guys, I wanted to talk about real life colors, make it a little more natural. And that's what, I, that's what I think we've done. It has been fun. I hope you've had fun. I hope it's not been too weird. I hope you're sticking with me as we figure this out. We're figuring it out together. It's us, me and you. So we're going to get there. We're going to do this. We're going to get on to the next one. I hope you've had a good time and I hope you come back. I hope you follow my channel. I hope you check me out on Instagram and I think that's about it. Mm -hmm.